Hello everyone! My name is Talon and today we're going to be going to Boundary Bay. Now, so basically what Boundary Bay is, is it's a place where there's a beach and there's a playground and you can go and find crabs on the beach. So we're going to be going there now and I really hope you enjoy this video. So we're going to be going there now! Disclaimer, if you cannot see my face at all right now, that's because it's actually, it's actually on the way back and it is so incredibly dark and late right now. So, yeah, that's why you probably can't see my face, really. So, that's just, yeah, that's just what's going to be happening. But anyway, let's go! So, as you can see, I'm now at the um, playground and... I'm climbing on the big climbing structure. This playground is really cool. There's lots of stuff. And now, so, I am trying to climb up the uh, climbing structure and I'm actually thinking I'm too big, which actually I turn out to be too big. It's too bad. I really do enjoy doing these climbing structures. So yeah, and here you can see me, um, I actually got stuck here, and I'm trying to get out, and yeah, so that happened. I thought I was going to be stuck there for longer, but I was helped out, so yeah, there we go. So, I'm here, I'm just going along, and at first I didn't know that I was going to be able to find such cool things here. I actually found some snails, and here you can see Mickey holding one. Mickey is the person I went out with, and yeah, so there it is. We'll show you it in a minute, I'm pretty sure. Yep. And Enjoy. here, Mickey finds a bit of a crab bit. It broke apart at the joint because crabs shed their exoskeletons. And here I show you the beautiful snail. These shell holes are just great. Their patterning is beautiful. Really, really cool. So, yeah, there I find a snail. Yeah, so here I'm wading out into the water. I have my blue rubber boots on so I can do that without getting just soaked. And here we're trying to find more snails. It's like when you get to a good part, it's quite easy to find a whole bunch of them. We're trying to relocate just to see. In this little pile, I didn't find any, so we keep moving. I really enjoy being at Boundary Bay. Well, we it was just we when you look out, uh, out like we from the water, then you can just see like out to the water. You can just see basically nothing, just the calm water. It was so calm water. It was great. I really enjoyed being there. We grow our skin gets bigger with us, right? Mm -hmm. We actually shed skin cells. And yeah, crabs and it, shed their exoskeletons. Yeah, you got it, crabs shed their exoskeletons. So, do you think this is a dead crab or has it just shed its ex exoskeleton? Uh, that looks like... Is that a dead crab? Good question. There's one way to tell. Mm -hmm. I'll show you what it is. Mm -hmm. What you have to do is you have to smell it. Mm -hmm. And if it smells like the ocean, so like a little bit weird, but not that bad, mm -hmm. then that means it's a crab that molted or yeah. shed its exoskeleton. And if it smells like the worst thing you have ever smelled in your entire life, then it smells like dead crab. Okay. Or then it's a dead crab. What smell do you think? Okay, I know what it is. What? You can come smell it and tell me. No. No, you're not going to? No. No? Well, no. Are you sure? I'm sure. You don't want to try it? Mm -hmm. What if I told you that it smells fine? Mama! Yes. <laughs> I like 
bark. Okay. Well, if, if Mickey put her nose that closely, I think I can too. Great. Because I'm guessing it's not bad. That one is a female? It is. Nicely Water. done. Do you want to explain it to your um, video? Well, they have a thing on their belly, kind of a, a little line. A shape. Yeah. A shape. How do you Whatever. call that again? I, I forgot that. Mickey? Oh, you know that. I know you that. You told me before. Something about a house. Yeah, yeah. there you go. What? Okay, hang on. Uh, but Mickey, you if it looks, if, if it's a male, it looks like a lighthouse at the bottom. I've also had people say it maybe looks like a crayon. And if it's a female crab, it looks more like a beehive, kind of. Yeah. Right? It's yeah. a female crab, which means she lays eggs, mm -hmm. right? And they keep their eggs mm -hmm. underneath, right in here. Yeah. They just store them like that. It's so blue. if you find a female crab that has lots of eggs, mm -hmm. you'll see little orange things sticking out. Mm. Is it a dead crab? No, this is a molted crab. What? But this one is freshly molted. Do you want to smell this one? Yeah. You smell oh. it. Sorry. No, no, it even it. has its eyes still. Eye oh, casings. No. Not its eyes. Its eyes go out, but its eye casings stay in. And then, when we lift this up, so they wriggle out the back like this, and they leave their shell behind, but they also leave something else behind. What? Do you know what these things are? No. Those are their gills. Oh. So they leave their gills behind, and they grow whole new ones. Yeah, that's what little gills look like. Sorry, John, it's kind of flooding. Oh, those, um, can you point that for you? Yeah. Oh. This is the beautiful dry foam. Just you do not know what it is, how beautiful yeah. this light is. It's like I can't get it outside the car. That would be dangerous. Like seriously. Ah, I can't get it. We were actually in Delta, which is another part of Vancouver, and it was so cool. Yeah, so the drive home was so beautiful. It was like I saw this just orange glow in the sky. It was like, oh my gosh. It was seriously the most beautiful drive I've ever experienced. And it was in the dark, and f uh, the fog made it so that you could see that glow. It was so great. I was so happy, and I just had to film it. So I rolled down the window, and then I'm like, so, uh, and then I'm like, okay, I'm filming this, and I think it was great. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you've ever been to Boundary Bay, tell me what you've seen in the comments below. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and bye bye for now.